Now this is a key that was used by her for several years and they took the key and meticulously scrubbed it for DNA and that was at first glance a good thing but they came up and represented that the only DNA found on that key was Stephen Avery's. That is patently ridiculous. Any crevices, anything else in that key would have retained her DNA. And for them to be able to say only Stephen's DNA is on this indicates to me that that key was scrubbed clean and his DNA was placed on it. Study after study has shown when, when more than one person handles an object like a doorknob, a light switch, or whatever, um, you, will, you will get a mixture of DNA on it. And somebody who who's, uses a key every single day, think about how many times you touch that thing. All the crevices in the key, on the handle of the key, they, it was swabbed all the way around. And they didn't find a bit of Teresa Hallbach's DNA on that key. Thank you.